muscle in the body is it's your jaw so get over it your eyelids have the fastest moving muscles they contract in a fraction of a second without your pinky you'd lose about 50 percent of your hand strength <gasps> the rear? and headache are connected because of the trigeminal nerve i love this podcast right to the head i love this when podcast you're asleep, your sense of smell turns off so if there's a when you're smell asleep, in your sense of smell turns off. Did you know that? Your sense of I'm trying to turn this off. If you eat too much. Your sense of smell turns off when you sleep. And we lose about 40% of our taste buds by the time we're 60. I love this podcast. What's going on, everybody? My name is Jenna. This is 1111 with Jenna. I'm here seven days, seven nights, 14 times a week at 1111 a.m. and 1111 p.m. Eastern Time every single day since March 20th, March 24th, 2020. I am going to go to edit privacy and go public right there, right now. So now all of you that are watching, even though there isn't anybody watching at all, and I gotta make sure. I am there, okay, I'm here, okay. So we're gonna do a, a short show today. So let me bring on my friend, ladies and gentlemen, where'd he go? disappeared. Jeff. Hey, Patty Loman. Oh, and then everything just went blue. There he is. One more time, ladies and gentlemen. Jeff Metzger in the house. Already done, Patty. Thank you. Good morning, Attorney Metzger. How are you? Good morning. Let me get my whole my whole being in here. At least the top half. Your whole being. Who's here? Patty. Who's here? Loman. Patty Loman and two unidentified people. Could be some of your people. I don't know. What's shaking? What's going on? How's life? Fine, fine. What, what's life? I got to remind me at, at, at uh, 25 minutes after the hour, I've got my retrieve my reservation so I can get my number for Southwest. Uh huh. Do it now at 1124. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. At 25. So I've got that set. So I'm, if we're still talking, <clears throat> I'll have to hit the button so I can get my seat assignment. Is this for New York? For when you go no, see your son? I'm going, to, I'm going to your neck of the other neck of the woods tomorrow. Really? I'm going to do two nights with Bob at the Seaweed Water on a Sunday oh, morning. Sweet. That's a fundraiser for. Um... Yeah, do you know the two? Is it two? One's the, what's his name? Who, his bandmate who's waiting for a kidney, and the other one Ace is his, their former. You know him, and the other ones are former drivers. Yeah, I know the bass player. I used to work with him. If you if you meet him, tell him that Jenna Mamina said hello. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what kind of shape he's in, or whether he's actually going to be there. Or I think he'll be there. I think he was planning, but maybe not. Yeah, my brain's not working this second. So exciting. Those things right? popped up, and so I decided, you know, after the trial, I figured, okay, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Put the traveling shoes on. Where are you staying? My sister's who lives nearby there. She's in Mill Valley. Sorry. No, no, she's in San at San Anselmo. Oh, even better. So I'll get to a couple days and uh, you know and get that be able to do that too. Man, and I'm going to be there in about well 
well, not until the 12th, so a while yet, a couple weeks. I'm going to Seattle. Seattle. Uh, I'm going to Seattle on the 8th. Hello, DK. Come hang out on the show. In the I am Bay Area. In the Bay Area after that, huh? I'm flying, well, I'm flying from Seattle to Santa Rosa, which I've never done before. I've not flown in that airport. It's Charles Schultz, teeny tiny little airport. But fly, instead of flying from Seattle to San Francisco and then get up to my sister's, I'm flying into Santa Rosa and then they're going to pick me up. So you got a nonstop from Seattle to Santa Rosa? Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Well, Alaska flies out of this airport, the Santa Rosa airport. So what, uh, so you, and how long are you in, uh, in, in our great state? I'm going to be in um, our great state. I'll be here there um, a while. And then I'm going, then I come back and then Grace and I, we're heading out. And then I'm going to New Orleans, New Orleans, and then to New York. Right. I'm excited. Big, big few months ahead of a lot of movement, but it'll be good. Yeah. Kind of, I kind of want to stay here now. <laughs> I like being in my house. I'm putting up a, you can't see it, I don't think. Can you see it? Oh, no, you can see my other painting. I'm putting up a big cow over my bed. I have a bit of a cow thing. Don't everybody start getting me cow things, please. I just like paintings of really cool cows. It's in my DNA. So what's today? Well, I got a pack at some point, getting a haircut at some point. We've got the dogs here, probably Oh, they're both work. there right now. Yeah, prep work That's for my brief nice. too in a couple weeks, and so. Nice. Tell us about dinner last night. Well, you know the the uh, my paralegal grows a bunch of stuff on her her property or her, her house, so she's always bringing me stuff, and she has orange trees. And her, free, her oranges are friggin' delicious. Oh my God, they're really good. So I started thinking, I had a bunch of that, and I said, you know what? I'll make, let me make something with it. Oh yeah, you know that chicken dish I haven't made for a while with citrus and soy. So I decided this week to dig out the recipe and make it on Friday. And, um, and Allie and Joey and our friend Carol came. So we, I made it. Carol the, the or Carol's not the orange grower. No, no, Carol's a friend of ours who's, who generally doesn't eat meat, but she made an exception, you know, for, I mean, she's, you know, she's just not a real carnivore, but, you know, she, she picks her spots. She eats fish, but, so, but this one, this dish is not to be missed, but it's a lot of work, you know, I had to, I was up yesterday morning and thawing all the meat, and then, uh, you know, the marinade, it's all from scratch. What's in the marinade? marinade. Uh, the marinade's got soy sauce and garlic and fresh ginger and um, brown sugar and zest. I think that's probably it. Lemon, lemon and orange zest. And then, um, so you marinate now all day. Then the meat's uh, dredged in uh, cornstarch and, and uh, lightly browned on both sides. And then it's, then the remaining marinade gets poured over it and it's cooked in its marinade in the oven, 40 minutes. And then it comes out and the, pull the thighs out. It's all, it's all bone in thighs. Pull the thighs out, add the citrus that I had used all the morning. I had uh, squeezed limes and not limes, but lemons and oranges. Put that in the remaining sauce, a little sriracha, a little sriracha. Cook it for you know, 15, 20 seconds. Boom, 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 pour it over the thing. Sprinkle scallions and sesame seeds and voila. Yeah. So it is, it's a lot of work. I haven't done it for a while, but it's, it, it, it is just really a fantastic dish. All those Asian flavors all coming together, you know. Sounds good. And what do you serve with this? I, I just made, I just used jasmine rice and just uh, steamed some rice and just threw a little lime and, and chopped up cilantro and also from 
from uh, my paralegal's garden. And, you know, a little garlic and a little little uh, sesame oil and threw a salad with it. And that was it. Sounds really good. And to drink? We had peanuts last night. From? Um, Central Coast. We were drinking two from Central Coast. Love the Central Coast. I think, I think Cross Barnes Central Coast. I know Byron is. Almost all wine from the Central Coast because I just love the Central Coast. Yeah. I really do. Cambria. I'm a Cambria. We're going there, and we're going there in two weeks. The Cambria? Well, Pass Robles, but. Um, Will you go to Cambria also? Just you know, I guess one day we could. Maybe we're on our way out of town. We're doing that. We're going to Stakeet and uh, Gazelle will be in town. Grab, go grab a little um, little to-go food at Mezzo Italiano, right you downtown know, Cambria. We're, we're going from Paso Robles up to Pacific Grove. You know what Pacific Grove is? Mm -hmm. Next to Carmel. For a couple of days with some friends of ours there. You know, maybe on the way back when we leave, or maybe we stop in Cambria on the way. Ask for, you'll see it. Ask for Victoria, say you're Jenna's friend. She's going to go, oh my God. Ah, she makes a lot of really good vegan food, but has other stuff also. She does a lot of Italian food, but she makes these vegan, here we go again, green balls, as opposed to a meatball. She makes a meatball, but she makes a, a mean green ball. And she used to work, do you remember Square One in San Francisco back in the 90s, 80s, 90s? Fabulous restaurant at one market. She worked, she was the um, oh shit. pastry chef. Yeah, one market. Well, if, we, if we get Cambria on our itinerary, I'll, I'll talk to you about that. I made a good uh, vegan pasta the other night. Mm. Just, well, uh, just sauteed uh, garlic and chopped olives and red pepper flakes and, and sauteed spinach into it. Boom, boom, boom. I guess. We did sprinkle cheese on it afterwards, but that's that was optional. I had some vegan bacon yesterday from a company in San Francisco called Hooray. So good. I made I made a zucchini. Oh, you gotta go. Uh, call, call. Right. Glad I did this. Zucchini waffle, pistachios with romaine lettuce, and then um, this hooray. Oh, with a little bit of um truffle butter Ooh. so the, the vegan went out the door with the truffle butter but worth Ooh. it did Ooh. you get it what truffle butter no it's, I, I did a minute early i have to wait for another 30 seconds yeah or so. i do that just keep what's your prediction what's your prediction of what i'm going to get <clears throat> <clears throat> well and it's to it's up right straight up to san francisco or oakland okay Orange County to Oakland. Well, probably a lot of people just pay the 10 or 20 bucks, but you maybe. Know, you know what? I need to because I knew I'd be on, so it's no big. And it's just me and it's. So maybe a, a 14. Oh, no, that's the first 15 are, are for the. It's always starts at 15. There's going to be 15, 15 of them? Okay. Wait, let's see. A 16. Now a 17. Somewhere between 14 and 20. That's why Lily. You got A15? A59. 59. 59. Wow. I am in the A group. <laughs> what time? Well, 24 hours from now, 8, 8 no. 25. Oh, 8 25. 8 25 in the morning, yeah. Oh, you didn't tell me it was the, the earlier morning flight. I thought you were well, leaving around noonish. Well, I couldn't do it. You only can do it 24 hours ahead. I know I wasn't thinking. I mean, and I'm also looking at anyway. So a fifty nine. Well, you're in the you're right behind the cutoff, or right in front of the cutoff. Yeah, yeah it's Come it'll on. be fine. Working. See you tonight, William D. Tonight, my friend Tati. She lives in California. She's going to be on the show, and she. Not Gary. Is... Not no. Gary. Oh, 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 Gary is taking some time off. He is, his brother is in town and they're going through their family home. And, uh, and he has concerts to go to. 
that's what I was going to have you ask me. So I went to see Patty Smith a couple of nights ago. That yeah. Was Capitol Theater. That would have been just, I stuck somebody else who went, oh my God, it had to be great. Hey, Rob Morocco. We're coast to coast in Canada too. So Gary is not on. Okay. He's taken off for a little bit and he may be back before March 24th, but they, they his brother is there for one month and they are drilling in on the house. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you're going up. What are you, are you going to go out to dinner somewhere? Fun? No, because, you know, we'll get mine, you know, probably hang out with friends. And so I'll do lunch. Are you gonna go have, where are you going to have lunch? My sister's got a couple of places lined up. We may go to Soul oh. Food in San Rafael. That's always one of my favorite. You've been to Soul Food, right? Yeah. I love Soul Food. Do you? So maybe uh, she says she has another new place somewhere. In, you know, it's Santa kind of a, well, actually on Thursday oh, nights, Thursday nights at Soul Food, um, a friend of mine plays music outside, which is fun. I just, you know, the hype for that, for rice and beans and some tortillas and some, I, I just don't. Well, you don't eat the chicken. If you don't eat the chicken, then you might be, right? If you, I mean, it's the chicken is the, is the. Yeah, I've had the chicken. I've tasted it. It's chicken. You make better chicken than that. Proprietary uh, hot sauce. Oh, is that good? You make better chicken than that. I just, it's just loud in there for me. But I like to be outside anyway. When Edgardo and those guys are playing. That's their, they might be there. Well, you won't be there tonight. They'll be there tonight, though, probably. I think they're back to playing. Um, okay, so you're good. And then what? Oh, there are two nights of playing. Rob, and, or who's playing with Bob? Wolf Brothers. So I, and I, they did a thing from, you know, it's a tiny stage, as you well know. So one thought was, you know, the Wolf Brothers now is, uh, is, is consists of five. That's the technically the Wolf Brothers. That's with Jay and Don and Jeff and Greg List. Then they have the Wolf Pack. Right. The horns and the strings. And so the thought was that um, uh, the stage was too small. It would just be the Wolf Brothers, not the Wolf Pack. But then Bob uh, went live on Instagram the other night during the rehearsals and the Wolf Pack was there too. So because I think they're using this as a, a probably kind of a dress rehearsal for the tour that starts next week. Oh yeah, of course. So, there, so paid you would, rehearsal, so, huh? Paid rehearsal. Yeah, for good causes and uh, my he's yeah. he's so totally in my head right now. I guess it'll be all nine or ten of them. Sounds like I can't think of his name. Nine fifty eight fifty nine, Julie. No, eight fifty nine for a round trip ticket. No, that's not what we were talking about. You didn't say. Did you say eight fifty nine eight hundred and fifty nine dollars for a round? Hey. Hey, the letter A. Yeah. He's on Southwest Airlines. You Southwest. you get your net. You get your number. He's A five nine. You know he's he's right behind six. And I just got my boarding pass. Yay! Add the Apple Wallet. Done. Robin Sylvester, thank you. My brain just wasn't going. And anywhere. the princess just arrived. I was waiting. The princess, come here, little girl. And, oh, and we, got both. we got them both. They're both here. Let's see how I can do this. How do I switch? Okay, let's do it this way. Oh, they just left. <laughs> Layla, Wes, where are you guys? I got to switch it back. Oh, here they are. Layla, Wes, come here. Come here. Doing? Here she comes. Layla. No, they're looking for toys or something. They're looking for food. No, not yet. They want toys. This is playtime. This routine is they, and they'll probably start playing together. They'll start tug of war here. And then, come on, guys. Wes, come. So no, when Wes is over, is there no poetry morning? Yeah, she's, she hasn't been doing that much of that lately because Layla's been getting up earlier. Okay, well, I guess I'll have to wait till they come in. Not going to happen. Is your sister going this go? She's not. Well, I hope you have a blast. Uh huh? 
Yeah, I'm sure you'll fun. have a blast. I said, I hope. Other friends, going. colleagues going. Yeah. Very important. So it's his driver also, you said? One of the nights is to raise money for his driver, their driver. I guess it was Bob and Natasha's driver for a long time who's passed away. So I guess it's, that's what it said in the uh, announcement for the shows. Huh. So one night for one, one night for the other. Maybe you can stop by Larry's store and grab a new shirt. Um, where? Down in Mill Valley. He, he was, it was called Famous for Our Look for a long time. And now he's got it as a new, what is it called now? He's part of the whole Sweetwater. You, you've seen him. He's part of that scene. Larry the Hat. You've never met Larry the Hat? I don't think I've met Larry the Hat, no. My Buddhist project. I'm just trying to see where his new store. And anyway, it was famous for our look. It was in Mill Valley for 30 years. Men's and women's fashions. Fabulous clothes. He'll probably be there tonight. Or tomorrow night, sorry. I wish I was going to be around. It'd be fun to meet up with you guys. Meet your sister. If you were in town, you would have gotten a nod. Maybe. Let's see. Maybe your sister could come. I have a show in Vallejo on May 13th with a guitarist, oh, Pepino Diagostino and John Arbor, the three of us. May 13th? Mm hmm So you're in New Orleans two weeks earlier, then there, and then New York the week after. Yeah, you are going to be running around. Mm -hmm. oh, wait. I don't need this now. This is done. Okay, we're done with this one. We'll turn this one off. Yeah, the next two and a half months are kind of that's good normal for me, but rattling a bit. I'm like, do I really want to do all that right now? As I, I'm just putting up some new shelves and a new painting, and I've got I'm in my collage groove. But I get in a pretty good collage groove when I'm in California, so that's what I'll do a little bit. But I'll be in Seattle for five days, which I'm really looking forward to probably go do a show up on the rooftop of my friend's place and well you're going in two weeks you said I leave on yes. February or March 8th March 8th then the Bay Area then here then back to the Bay Area then to New Orleans <coughs> back to the Bay Area then to New York okay uh, two weeks let's see unless I find oh no I have to go back to the Bay Area because May 13th is why I'm going back to the Bay Area. Long range so forecast for you is it's going to be in the 40s for the high and the 30s and the low. It's going to be chilly. But you're not, you're used to that. So, no, I'm not. I'm usually what? in Mexico right now. I'm not usually in Mexico for six months. Not at all. Yeah, true, true. Okay, okay. But I do okay. have shorts on right now. Yeah, right now you. And Lisa and I would be hanging out at the San Pancho Music Festival along with Rob Morocco. That's right. It's the weekend, isn't it? This is the weekend. Carol, Patty, yeah. The gang. This weekend or last weekend? It's this weekend, this weekend. isn't it? Last weekend of February. True. That's right. It would be this weekend. Yep. No bueno. It's, you know, again, like my DNA just shows that I, I should be in, and I do, I have on shorts. But then, then New Orleans will be fun. I'm looking forward to that because Will Bernard is, I'm having him invite other people to sit in with us. Is the festival running now? No, they canceled it in November. First weekend in November, they canceled. No festival this year. They are doing a festival in Lo de Marcos in March. Oh, they are? Really? In Lo de Marcos, but yeah. That's even smaller than Santa Pancho. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? We were just, we would be in San Pancho right now. Uh -oh. I kept the dogs at bay as long as I could. There they are. Oh, it looks like Wes got a haircut. A couple weeks ago, yeah. Wes, get the ball. Get the ball from Layla. Come on. They're so cute. Hi, Layla. Layla, girl. Layla. 
Now, when you when you play that song loud, does she turn at all? No. We haven't done that. We should play it. We haven't played it in a while. We should see what she does. But not really, no. Come on, guys. Go get the ball. Let's go. Let's, let's rough. Let's go. Doorbells, however. There we go. Go for it. Doorbells. What about what go. about dogs on TV? Drop yeah. him, Layla. You got to drop awesome. him. There you go. Oh, you, you got the ball. Yeah, doorbell because she thinks it's something for her from Amazon, right? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Oh, they're such a kick. Lillian has a little friend that she plays with. His name is Teddy, he's about six months old, and they do the, this whole tumbling dance, and then she moves her head into his head, all cute. It's really fun, kind of like that, yeah. Aw, I see my alarm's going off now. I have a contractor downstairs, is the, fe no, the downstairs there you go. doing stuff, aw. I'm gonna go referee the, the festivities here. All right, thank you. Thanks for being here, Lisa. I'll see you maybe May 13th, you guys. Jump. May 13th. That's no, no, we leave on the 15th for Hawaii. So that probably oh, well, oh. closer. Oh, yeah, no, it's not. I think, yeah. Forget what? It. Never mind. Another gig, another time. Another gig in the area. Because you can't okay. make New York. When are you going to Hawaii? The 15th? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Have a great day. I don't know what you're doing today. What are you doing? What are you guys? What's, up? What's, this? What? What's the itinerary for today? We have some fish here from New Zealand guys, so I think maybe we'll do that. But it'll be much more low key than that. Yeah, I can tell. Have a good time. Get him, Wes. Get her. We're live from the show. She's pulling it. Let's whisper. Do a live from the show. Yeah. Okay. Is she pulling at your whiskers? What's going on, guys? All right, guys. Okay. See you later. Thanks, Jeff. See you, Lisa. Oh, you, See got the, you got the contractor today, huh? What? What? Oh, the contractor. Yeah, he's gonna hang. He's gonna hang the cow. Friend of mine painted the cow. It's really cool. Hang the what? The cow. She's got a big, big cow. cow. A forty by forty inch cow. Ooh. Oh, that's a big piece. Okay, go do it. All right. Talk to you next. See you next, yeah, next See you week. Jeff. Please. Jeff Metzger, Lisa Metzger, everybody. Standing ovation. <laughs> All right. Well, it's down to one, and it's not even my mom. So whoever you are that's still here, thank you very much. Um, I loved last night with Rob. I loved that whole Naruto thing and that brief. Carol, if you're listening or watching, wow. Wow. The painter of wool. It's not even painter of yarn. It's the painter of wool. It's the painter of microorganisms. Wow. You are just so... And I put up the... Um, C for cow. Okay. I put up the uh, the photo that you did of me that you made up. I forget what you call it. You know what I'm talking about. Anyway... I'm gonna go right now. I'm gonna go right now. I'm gonna go because I am going to hang a cow. Yes, another backdrop for 1111. It's a cow, although I could put it there too. Ooh, I could put the cow in my kitchen. I could put the cow in my kitchen. I could put the cow in my bedroom. I could do everything. Hello, Tammy Jarrett. I could put the cow in my kitchen. I could put the cow in that living room. I just can change it whenever I want. Oh my goodness, everybody. Thank you, Jeff Metzger. Thank you, Lisa Metzger. Thank you, Lila and Layla. My neighbor's Lila. The dog is Layla and the dog is Wes and Lillian Pearl. I love her the best. Oh, because I will see what happens tonight. Tati will be here. Hati Tati. See you guys later. Stay safe, stay healthy, and be real nice. And from your thoughts, make them caring thoughts. And from your words, make them a cacophony of words. And from your heart. 
especially now and every moment forward. Make it a caring heart. Have a beautiful day, everybody. Love heart. Thank you, Patty. Real heart.